Uh, Phantom says, my eight players for the tournament are... I tell you what, Phantom, because you've put the work in, I'm actually going to give you the floor. This is what we do on this community. So Phantom has given us a tournament here for signing of the season, and we're going to run it. And he didn't even do a super chat for it. So that's just how diverse this chat is. So Phantom has given us a tournament here for signing of the season. So let me just get this out. We'll start with quarterfinal one. This is what we do. Okay, yeah, it's good. I tell you what, he's done. I tell you what, you can have my job, goal, um, Phantom. This is brilliant. He's done a great job. This is, I couldn't have done this myself. This is great. This is brilliant, mate. You've done really well. Give yourself a clap. So we've got eight players for signing of the season, as uh, set up by uh, Phantom Ass. I hope I've pronounced that right. No one wants, no one wants a Phantom Ass. How are you going to go for a shit? Um, end poll. Alison beat Courtois. So we're going to do... We're going to do... Uh, just do me a favour, by the way. Please do subscribe to the channel. Bottom right-hand corner. We're about five subscribers away from 77,000. So please do subscribe. Get involved. Uh, we might be doing Aston Villa Sheffield United on Friday night, by the way, as a watch-along. Um, if enough people are interested in it, we might well do it. Because it's a chance for Villa to go top of the league. I can tell you now, Cole Palmer's not in the eight. Don't blame me, blame Phantom. It's got nothing to do with me. So, this is signing of the season so far. And our first quarter final is going to be Declan Rice against the Abbey. Hmm. Phantom, your first one was a bit shit. This one, the next one, right? Rice is, Rice is won that easy. He's made a tit of himself there. Uh, thanks, gems, for gifted membership. Right, second. So Declan Rice is through. Second quarter final is a good one for. Uh, I'm interested to see how this is going to go. This is probably the most exciting one. Ward Prowse or Doku? Uh, I tell you what, I, I sort of agree with Vatongan Goat. He says English tax is crazy. James Ward Prowse has got 65% of the vote here. Now, I thought this would be close, but this is just an example of bias because, and not Brexit bias, Doku, a couple of weeks ago, would have won this with 80% when he scored those goals and got all those assists. Um, but like just Jackler said, um, I hope you're doing well, pal, by the way. Doku had one good game. And I think that Doku game a few weeks ago probably would have got him to win it. But he hasn't done particularly well since, has he? I mean, he was uh, the last couple of games I've watched him play was pretty shit. So Ward Prowse looks like he's going to win this. We'll give it a few more. Jan says no one ever votes for City players anyway. Uh, I think we're going to give that to Ward Prowse. He's won that. So third quarter final. Rice and Ward Prowse are through. It's very English at the moment. Why is that? Uh, kudos. Kudos. I can't spell. Kudos versus Sir Bosley is our next one. Sabozlai, sorry. Uh, Sabozlai has won here 38% to 64%. Right, final quarter final. Um, I think I know which way this one will go. But I do just want to say I low key think that you might get it wrong. But uh, it's Vicario against Madison. And all Spurs are fair. Some people might say it's not fair. But Spurs never win anything, so at least they get someone in the semi-final. Easy. It's very close between Vicario and Madison here. Very, very close. I think Vicario is the signing of the season for me. He is as valuable to Spurs as Alisson to Liverpool, says Jay. Well, I'm actually surprised this is 50-50 between Vicario and Madison. And I think it I think it does display um, the differing football knowledges. Because Madison's been a bloody brilliant player for Spurs. 
but he's also been out for a month. Whereas I think Vicario is, for me, I think Vicario is probably my signing of the season. And I'm not here to, we're only at quarterfinal stage, but they got him from Empoli. Nobody knew who he was. James Madison even admitted he had to look at YouTube videos. And some of his savings this season have been incredible. Absolutely incredible. So I think, I bet they paid hardly anything for him as well. Um, I think he's been brilliant, but it's 50-50 at the moment. We're waiting for a winner. Love it. Right, I'm giving it to Vicario because he's gone to 51% and life's too short. So we're doing signing of the season so far. We're, in, we're into the semi-final stage now, which means it's uh, Rice versus Ward-Prowse. This should be close because you should be looking at comparatively the job that Ward-Prowse has done at West Ham. Um, let's see if it actually is. Um, Rice is into the final. He's beaten Ward-Prowse comprehensively with 73% of the vote, which means our second semi-final is going to be Vicario. No, 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 not that. Vicario versus... Could we get a shock in this semi-final? Because it could be... It could be... Who could it be? Who could it be? Here we go. Uh, Sabozli, isn't it? Sabozli. Sabozli. Sabozli, Mark. I'll tell you what. Sabozli and Vicario is very close. I'm going to keep it going. And I've, I've got to say, Sabozli's had a very good season. But I'm very impressed with the That's Football community that you're giving so many votes to Vicario. Because I think he's been bloody brilliant this season. Uh, Vicario has been more consistent, says Paolo. It's going to go to Sabozle. I can't. I can't do anything about that. It's going to be Sabozle. He's got fifty-four percent. Change the poll. I've got to change the poll. We're into the final now. We are into the final. And the final is um, Rice against Sabozle. Is your final for signing of the season so far? Uh, Rice is winning the f the poll of the final for who is the signing of the season. Um, Sabozlai has got 47% and Declan Rice has got 53%. Lewis Robinson says, people are forgetting one thing here. Rice cannot be signing of the season when he cost £100 million. That is a very good point. I think Declan Rice has been a very good signing, but for £100 million, should he not be signing of the season look at the no one's looking at the price